think if we didn't have propeller, there'd be a lot more people on our projects, that's for sure. It would take a lot more people to get done what we can do with fewer right now. When I came here to Hensel Phelps, uh, it came about that we had a project where we were going to be self-performing the earthwork. And this job is a design-build process. We decided to use this job as a pilot example. I was trying to think and brainstorm of what the best tool for the job would be. Some of our guys in the estimating department wanted to really track production and quantities and how much money we're going to make, how much we're going to lose, and there were some softwares that came out and Propeller was one of them. Some of our project superintendents, they were against it. They had some tricks up their sleeve, some experience that they could track this information on their own. And then some of the younger staff who had very little experience with tracking the operations of Earthworks go, we were all for it. We typically fly every two to three days, so we're able to see constant production. We're able to make reports based on what had actually happened each day. We're able to compare how much fill we have remaining on the project, and then the stockpile quantities that we're able to utilize. Prior to Propeller, we never really did a lot of earthwork scope. When I say that, I mean we didn't self-perform it. We usually would hire a subcontractor in here, use their expertise to help us plan our work, how we're gonna excavate, how we're gonna grade, how we're gonna backfill. With the help of Propeller, we, Hensel Phelps, we can hire our own operators, and we can go out there and plan our work utilizing this software. And maybe we didn't quite understand all its capabilities, but we knew that there was potential with Propeller, so we wanted to institute it on this project. And the more we used it, the greater we saw the value and asset that it was to the job. We use it daily. As a company, Hensel Phelps is always looking to what's the next best thing, how can we improve. For safety especially, we use this, um, like I said, with orientation, trenching, excavations, things like that. And it helps a lot with not only making it easier on me, on our staff, but safer for the guys out in the field. With Propeller, we really encourage all of our field staff and office staff to utilize it to plan our work. We're looking at quantities. We're using the drone pictures, flying out there, using that to do our site logistics plans. We're using it to help in our sub-coordination meetings to show where underground utilities might conflict with an excavation we have out there and how we can keep people safe can relay real-time project information or data to them as far as production, quantities, really budget, a lot of things. You're able to share that in a more refined manner than rough quantities on paper. It's really easy to visualize the site. You're able to show them a lot more information. You're able to visualize the, the final product that you're trying to produce. We put in these civil elevations in there, and it will tell us, okay, you got more dirt to add over here, more cut to add over here, and Propeller can do it like that. So that we're not hauling off extra dirt, we are keeping and maintaining that most accurate amount of dirt that we need. It's the latest technology, it's easy to use, and it gives us accurate information. It's great. Time is money, right? So we were spending time internally in the VDC department processing our own data. You know, it wasn't uncommon that we would spend a few hours on each data set that we captured. Now with Propeller, we can capture that data set, hand it off, and 12 hours later we get a data set now. I mean, that's remarkable 